we're on the Morning Star out of Ocean City, Maryland, to see one of the ways the dedicated volunteers are helping to rebuild the lost coral reefs of the Mid-Atlantic. This is also a midwinter tautog fishing trip, but Captain Monty Hawkins makes sure that no trips into the ocean go to waste. Well, we take blocks with us every single day. We've done over 24,000 blocks. Right now I'm working on about seven different sites. Uh, you know, some sites have over 3,000 blocks. And, uh, and usually what we do is we connect. We'll either build on a reef that's sunken into the bottom or we'll connect two existing reefs that are very, very close together and try to make them one big reef. And uh, the project is working one way better than I ever would have dreamed. In 15 years, 20 years, it'll be coral. Soft corals and hard corals will start out with mussels right away. Uh, by early next summer, it'll be mussels up big time. And uh, you know we catch uh, we catch tog and sea bass, uh, flounder, some flounder in profusion by late summer. And uh, it's a project that just works and works and works. We also have the artificial reef program where we're dumping much larger things. We've uh, we've sunk four barges in the last eight months. It's a good project. It's great for ocean city. It's great for fishing off ocean city. Morning Star's mates put in the extra effort too, assembling blocks into what they like to call fish condos. These make excellent habitat. When the condos are ready to go, the mate signals to the captain. He then uses GPS to position the Morning Star in exactly the right spot. When the location is ideal, the fish condo goes overboard. Then, Monty fires the engines back up and heads for already established hotspots. There, he can put his clients on the fish. But a few years from now, Monty might be right back in that same spot where he pushed those blocks overboard, catching fish on New Reef. Don't miss another cool fish dog video. Click below to subscribe.